Hi guys! Happy Thursday! And welcome back to my channel, Couponing with Kayla. So we are outside of the Publix. I was gonna come over here yesterday, but just had too many things to get done yesterday. So we're about to head into Publix, check out the deals for this week. So your ad may have started yesterday or it may have started today. We're gonna go ahead, see what deals we can pick up. Got some good rebates, some good coupons. So hopefully we can get a lot of stuff for really cheap. So if you are completely new to my channel, welcome. Thank you so much for being here and if you enjoy the video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up as well as hit that red subscribe button below and the notification bell so you don't miss any new ones now I will also have a printable list below the video so you can print that out take it to the store with you it's gonna help make your shopping trip super easy also let me know if you are working on any I bought a bonuses anything like that I think that I just got my weekend whiteboard bonus and it is 15 offers for five dollars now I may or may not complete that today but I'll at least get a start on it depending on what all I pick up we've got some good Ibotta deals we've got some fetch rewards deals as well all right guys so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna head in here and see what all we can pick up today <laughs> Right, guys so the first deal we're looking at is on nexus and i kind of knew that this would be out of stock because i didn't come yesterday but we've got these five dollar printable coupons these nexus products are 4.63 so it makes each one a 37 cent money maker so definitely grab it if your store has it and i'll have that printable coupon link below the video all right guys, so next we're gonna look at this deal on Dove Men's Body Wash. They're buy two, get $3 off instantly at the register. I'm probably gonna go ahead and pick up four of them. I'm gonna use two of these buy one, get one free coupons. This says buy any one Dove Body Wash and get the Dove Men's for free. So you should be able to buy men's, get the men's for free. In our extra savings booklet, we also have a $2 off any two Dove. And so it has multiple products you can get and this is one of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab four of these for a total of $22.36. We also have a fetch promotion going on. So here is the promotion you can see right here on a $5 gift card when you spend $15 in Unilever products. This includes tons of stuff, you guys, and you're gonna get a $5 Publix gift card. So I'm gonna pick up four of the Dove Men for $22.36. After all the coupons and this promotion, it's gonna be completely free and a moneymaker, but I will show you that in just a second. We're gonna grab one other deal. All right, guys, so the next deal we're looking at is the Dove Hand Soap. So these are $3.99. We have the buy one, get one free, and the $2 store coupon. Again, these do count towards that Unilever promotion. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up four of these and use two of the buy one, get one free coupons and two of the store coupons. That'll leave me to pay $3.98, but we're going to get back $5.50 on Fetch, and we're going to talk about that in just a second. Okay guys, so you can mix and match the Unilever products however you wanna do it, but I'm gonna do the Dove Men's. My total is gonna be $22.36 before coupons, but after all the coupons I showed you guys, plus the $5.50 back on Fetch for those four, that's gonna make it a $4.32 money maker. Then the four Dove Soap totals me $15.96, but after all coupons, I'll pay $3.98, get $5.50 on Fetch, making it a $1.52 money maker. So all these products are gonna be completely free. All right, guys, so the next deal we're looking at is on the Huggies pull-ups. $10 off instantly when you spend 40 or more. So we are gonna go ahead, we are gonna grab some of these. I was scanning the different ones here in the store. The girls ones up here, they say um, $9.89, but they don't have the nighttime ones. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna grab three of the boys. They had one of the girl nighttime ones. I'm pretty sure they're all $10.79 each. I'm gonna use four of these $3 off coupons and I'll put on the printable list what insert that's from. But before coupons, we have a total of $43.16 after the $10 instant savings plus the four $3 coupons. We're gonna be left to pay $21.16. If we get back $3 for each pack on Ibotta like it's showing attaching, that'll be $12 back. And on Fetch, I have a spend 40, get 3,000 points, which is $3. So the final cost would be $6.16 for all four or just $1.54 each. 
all right guys so next up we've got a deal on the band-aid brand product so we're gonna grab two of these for a dollar 79 so that's 358 for two we have this three dollar coupon in our Publix extra savings booklet now we also got one dollar coupons in our most recent insert now this is a dollar off of one band-aid brand product and it says one per customer so I do have both the kids with me so if we count as three customers technically I should be able to use two of these so we'll see what they say up at the register but that is a dollar 42 money maker if i use both but if you only use one of the one dollar coupons from the paper it'd still be a 42 cent money maker so i think it's a good deal either way so next up guys we are looking at the nestle pure life water so buy one get one free at 449 i'm using two one dollar coupons it's going to take me down to 249 i'll put that on the printable list and there's also printable coupons i'll link below but we are going to go ahead pay 249 i'll get back 30 cents on ibotta because i have three 10 cent offers all right guys next up we're doing this new aisle deal so it's not in the app but anyways um i'll explain more here in a little bit but the aisle basically you buy the item then you submit on the text and they're gonna send you money so what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab two of these for 379 okay now they're gonna give two dollars back for each so it'll make it free and a 21 cent money maker for both let me know if you've tried these never tried these before they don't look real real good but we're gonna try them out and see how they are i mean for free we might as well go ahead and try them so next up we have the Grillo Pickle. So these are two for $8. Now I have a $1.50 coupon that I printed a little while back. Now let me know if you have this coupon, but it's good till September. So if you did print it, you can get $1.50 off of this. Now we also have a $2.50 I bought a rebate. So it's gonna end up making one of these completely free. So I think that is pretty awesome. Next up, we're going to do a deal on Beyond Burger. So this is Beyond Meat, Beyond Burger. We're going to go ahead and grab this. Use a $2 printable coupon. I'll have that link below. It's from their website. So I'm going to pay $3.89 in the store, get $1.50 on Ibotta, and $2 back from Isle. So that's going to make this just $0.39 cents for one, which is super awesome, almost free. Next, I'm going to grab the Dr. Prager's Turkey Burgers today. So I'm going to show you these in my cart. Okay, it was a little cold over there, so <laughs> we're going to look at these. They're buy one, get one free at $4.99. Two Dr. Prager coupons for $2 off. I'll have those linked below. So we're going to pay $0.99 cents for two in the store. I have a special pop-up offer on Fetch. See if you have it for $2 back on one. And then we have a dollar back on each for Ibotta. So that's going to make these free in a three oh one dollars moneymaker. So that is awesome. Next up, we're gonna grab a couple of school supplies. So these are buy one, get one free. At my store, in my area, they let you do half BOGO. So basically, you can get one at half the price. So I think I'm gonna grab some crowns for Axel. These are just 50 cents. The scissors up there are gonna be just about 75 cents. They have some color pencil deals as well, but my store is all out of those. But definitely some great deals that you can grab for back to school. All right, guys, next I'm gonna grab one of these gift cards. So it's buy. $50 worth of groceries get $10 off your purchase. Now it does have a $4.95 activation fee, but you're still gonna get about $5.05 off your purchase. So what I normally do is I take all my stuff up to the register, I ring up all my items, then I ring up the gift card. I do this $10 off coupon first, and then I do all my other coupons. And then when I type in my phone number at the end, that is when I'll hit pay and my digitals will come off. So we are gonna, if you have any digitals, anyways, we're gonna go ahead and go check out okay guys one more thing i forgot i have a 75 cent coupon on my app for milk so this is 289 it'll be just 214 with that coupon and i need milk anyway so i'm gonna go ahead and grab this half gallon all right guys so we are at checkout this is my total with everything before i do any coupons before i do the gift card so I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna scan the gift card, then we're gonna get the $10 off, and then we're gonna scan all of our other coupons and see how it goes. All right guys, so she came over and approved the gift card, approved the $10 off coupon. Now we're gonna start scanning these coupons. I'll let you know if we have any coupon beeps or anything like that. At Publix, you just put in your coupon as you go. So you'll scan it, put it in, um, all that good stuff. So, 
normally it goes pretty smoothly now you of course can go through regular checkout but for me i just like to do it here at the self checkout because i can kind of just make sure everything's coming off make sure i don't miss anything um yeah i just like self checkout <laughs> when i can use it um of course over at cvs and walgreens i always use regular checkout and they are awesome so definitely definitely like to do the self checkout when I can here at Publix and at Walmart but here at Publix it normally goes pretty smooth and if you have an issue they'll normally help you now these store coupons right here okay guys sorry <laughs> when you have a store coupon you're gonna type in the little number down here in the corner so go ahead type that in like a fruit or a vegetable it's gonna take off the amount so I forgot to show you the other one but it came off just fine as well so that's what you're gonna do each time you have a store coupon so you do have to type in each one and say if you're using four of a store coupon you've got to flip them all out type in the number each time and then you have to insert them each into the slot as you go all right, guys, didn't want to bore you showing you the same thing over and over. So on to our next coupons. We're going to do all of these Huggies coupons. And once we do these, I think we only have a couple more left. I saved my buy one, get one free ones for last just because they always have to come over and approve those. And now we've got our pickle coupon. All right, hold on just a minute. All right, guys, so she came over, manually entered the pickle coupon and also all the buy one, get one free coupons. And these are all my digitals that came off after I did my phone number. And this is my total with tax. All right, guys, so we are back in the car from Publix. The transaction went well. Um, the cashier came over and she entered all of the buy one, get one free coupons, all of that. My gorillas 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 pickle coupon beat now i'm not sure why she did go ahead and type it in so i'm like i hope i got the right item because i was thinking i was getting the right thing but now i'm like was there a different kind that i was supposed to get so anyways luckily she did put that through for me um so let me know if you use that coupon if you had any trouble with it anything like that um but we're about to head home we're gonna look over the receipt talk final cost of all of our items today so while we were in here we picked up an ice cream cake for chloe because her birthday's coming up on august 4th but the kids also go back to school on august 4th so she goes to seventh grade axel starts kindergarten so with that being said she's having over a couple of her best friends tomorrow we're gonna do some fun stuff have ice cream cake now she loves ice cream cake we get her an ice cream cake every year we get the cotton candy ice cream cake from baskin robbins but apparently there is a cotton candy ice cream shortage you guys like literally i've called three or four baskin robbins none of them have it so she was so sad because she can't get the cake that she really really wants um so we did end up getting her an ice cream cake here at publix it was like the one that has kind of like the crumble in the middle it looks pretty good and i told her i said we'll get the small one here and then um i will keep checking back hopefully they'll have the baskin robbins one for her actual birthday so that's what we're hoping for right yeah yeah she loves it so much <laughs> So that's what we're going for. I told her, I said, I don't care if they have it out of stock until October. I'll be like, here's your birthday cake. Happy birthday and trick or treat. <laughs> so no way we, we do what we got to do. Okay. But anyways, guys, we're going to head home. We're going to check out this receipt, see how much money we saved. And then I'm going to clean the house. So that way it's presentable when people come over tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? So <laughs> all right, guys, let's head to the house. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Alright guys, so I am back home and this is my Publix haul for this week. Got so many good deals, so I'm super excited to go over this receipt with you guys. So right here, we have about $184 worth of products. So I did do the $50 gift card deal. We're going to talk final cost after all coupons, all rebates. I'm going to show you guys my receipt. Now, before we go over the receipt, I do want to tell you guys, I did try out that new, um, what do you call it, aisle. So it's not really an app. It's more like you text them a picture of your receipt and then you get credit. So just to give you guys a heads up on that. So saving with Sarah, she posted about, about aisle. So I saw her post that last week wasn't really sure what that was so i looked it up um i did go ahead and search up their site which i will have linked below 
then once you get on there, it's kind of like, you know, you're signing up. It seems like you're texting back and forth because they're asking you like, what's your name and you know, that kind of stuff. So anyways, once you sign up, you're going to be able to look at what offers they have available. They're going to send you a text. The link will show you the offers they have available. And then when you do the offers, you can go ahead and just submit your receipt. Now you do your receipt, like take a picture of it, send it to them through text, and then they'll credit you by sending you money to Venmo. Now, if you're like me, I was not even signed up for Venmo. So it's kind of like, you know, PayPal, stuff like that. But for Venmo, I signed up on the Venmo app and then on Venmo, they can send you the money and then you can transfer that money to your bank account, however you want to do it. So it does say that if I complete two offers with aisle, that they'll give me a $5 um, kind of like bonus, like startup. So not only am I going to get my $2 back for each of these, but I'm also going to get back $2 for the Beyond Burgers. And I'm going to get back an additional $5 for doing two offers on my first receipt with them. So I'm excited about that. Um, I will pop up on the screen for you guys. It was really easy to sign up on there. Like I said, if you're like me, you don't have the Venmo yet. I will have a link for that below as well. And I think when you sign up on Venmo, if you send somebody like $5 or something like that, then you get $5 something. I don't know. <laughs> but I will pop up the details. I am completely new to that as well, you guys. But did go ahead and sign up so that way I can get my cash back from Isle. So that's really awesome. That is what I'm going to get back on those. Then besides that, we're going to go ahead and look over the receipt and we're going to talk other rebate apps that we know and are familiar with. So on Publix, the receipt right here, you can see here, I got the kids scissors for 75 cents, crayons for 50 cents. Um, then you can see the gauze there, the Dove hand soap. I got milk on this transaction, got the Beyond Burger, the Dr. Prager's, Everything seemed to be ringing up correctly. I didn't notice anything not ringing up correct. Um, the, what do you call it again? Grillo. Um, that was on sale for two for eight. So it did ring up $4. Then all of the pull-ups rang up for $10.79 each. The promotion for $10 off came off. The $3 for each two on the Dove, that promotion came off. So those are instant savings at the register. So you can see everything right there. Then we're starting off with our coupons. So on the coupon section of the receipt, you can see right here, I did the $50 gift card. It did charge the $4.95 fee. So you still get about $5.05 off of your purchase instead of $10 off. So it kind of bounces out there, still gives you some good savings. Then I have all of my coupons that I showed you guys in the store. All the manufacturer coupons are the ones that you see right here that say vendor coupon. Now, down right here, you can see anything that says like three off of two, that kind of thing. Those are store coupons. So I did the um, Band-Aid coupon. I did the Dove store coupons. And then I did more of my manufacturer coupons. Now down here, you can see she did type in the Dove. She typed in $5.49 each. Um, I think they were $5.59 each. So did get charged 10 cents higher on each of those. But still not a big deal. Um, you know, she was close there. So no complaints. Anyways. Then $3.99 off for each of the soaps, so that was correct. And then the digitals also attached because I think the reason that happens is with the buy one get one free coupons at Publix, they have to type them in manually. So when they type them in, the computer doesn't really know exactly what product that was for, if that makes sense. So then when you have digital coupons clipped on your account, they may come off as well. So it looks like I had a $1 Dove coupon clipped that was, I guess, for the hand soap. And and then um, another Dove Men's for a dollar off came off. And then I had a 75 cent coupon for a Publix digital coupon for the milk and a $3 off a $60 purchase. So that brought me down to $82.10. $50 of that was a gift card. So you can see right down here, it tells us how much we've saved. So store coupons, $24.75, vendor coupons, $44.46, and special price savings like buy one, get one free, and other sales, $33.47. So we saved a total of $102.68, you guys. Now, 
With that being said, I went ahead, submitted over to the rebate app. So on Fetch Rewards, I'm getting back 3,000 points for the Huggies. That was for spending over 40 on Huggies. I'm getting 2,000 for the Dr. Pregers. And then on the deal with the Unilever, for every $15 you spend on Unilever products, you get a $5 Publix gift card plus you get 500 points. So I ended up getting 1,000 points for my Unilever purchase today plus two $5 gift cards that they're gonna mail out to me. So that is um, $10 back in gift cards. So total from Fetch Rewards, we got back $16. Then on Ibotta, I went ahead, submitted my receipt to Ibotta. On Ibotta, the $1 and $2 offer that was attaching in the store when I scanned these did also credit on my receipt. Didn't have to change anything. It automatically did that. So that was pretty awesome. The Dr. Preggers got a rebate for that, Beyond Meat. Um, three water rebates for 10 cents each um, attached to the Nestle Pure Life. I think actually two water rebates and one juice rebate. So 10 cents for each of those. Then the Grillo had that rebate as well. Um, and then I had one Dove rebate attached. Not sure why, because I wasn't expecting a rebate for Dove. So I scanned some of these in the store. They didn't match up with the Dove body wash rebate. But I don't know if it's because one of these say naturals on it and they're the rebate is for like the naturals one. Anyways, it did give me back two fifty for one of those. So I don't know. I wasn't going to complain. So I got back a total of $20.80 from Ibotta. So overall today, you guys, between Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, and the new one, Isle, that got back a total of $11 from Isle. So that brought me down to $34.30. Now that was including a $50 gift card. Now if I was doing this deal with no gift card, anything like that, my total would have been around about $37, something like that. And then I would have got back same amount from Ibotta, same amount from Fetch, same amount from Isle. And it would have made this transaction a $10 moneymaker, a little over a $10 moneymaker. So that is definitely a really, really awesome deal. So you can do amazing with this deal no matter how you do it. I just went ahead and did it that way because I know I can use a $50 gift card anywhere. And by doing it that way, I got an extra $5 in saving off my purchase. So like I got a $50 gift card for 34 bucks and everything else was free. So not complaining at all. Let me know in the comments below if you are going to do any of these same deals. If you love shopping at Publix, I love shopping at Publix. I've been doing it kind of every other week here lately, but definitely, definitely love their deals and love to get over there and do some public shopping. So let me know in the comments below if you're going to do the deals. Don't forget to grab your printable list as well. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Bye guys.